So in general, PAH, you know, we call it as, you know, pulmonary hypertension and we call it, uh, we, we may think it's a lung disease, but in reality, it's a heart problem. It's failure of the right side of the heart to work properly. So the way it presents, it presents with shortness of breath on exertion, the same way left heart failure presents when it starts. And then it depends on the patient, you know, the baseline exercise capacity. For example, if somebody used to be a marathon runner, they may only be able to run two miles now, but that is still a symptom of pulmonary hypertension. Other people that are more advanced in their disease when they present to the doctor can be as short of breath, uh, breath as, you know, feeling, I, I like to quote this patient all the time, duck, when I go to the bathroom, I feel like I'm drowning. So some people are actually more advanced and could be that short of breath. Other symptoms that can be associated with pulmonary hypertension would be chest pains, particularly again on exertion, lightheadedness, be people feeling to, that are ready to pass out or even pass out when, uh, when, uh, when they try to exert themselves. Uh, they can get, get swelling of the legs, again that's sign of right heart failure, or they can get enlarged uh, liver and spleen and ascites, which is fluid accumulation in the, uh, in the abdomen. So that would be the typical uh, signs and symptoms of pulmonary hypertension.